Bill Cardinelli here to introduce an exciting addition to our top shelf lineup, the Zing Hybrid. The Zing Hybrid features the great performance core of the Zing, plus the hard hitting Dynama core, all wrapped in our super performing Forge 2 Hybrid cover. The Zing Hybrid offers more length and hard to believe more back end than the original Zing. It's all part of the radical revolution. I'm sure you want to know what the oil pattern is. Easy. That's the pattern. Probot allows us to mimic any bowler in the world, so we invented our own to best show off our products. Okay, it's time to meet our crew. Katie Carey is a low rev superstar, and her number one hits are dazzling strikes. Wayne Gripsky, this Hall of Fame lefty, is noted for his quick reactions and sharp moves. Chuck Norris, when Chuck's around, the pins go missing in action. Keanu Revs is a beast, a super two-handed. Katie Carey has a low ball speed and a low rev rate and prefers to keep the ball in front of her. So the added length of the Zing Hybrid makes all the sense in the world. The pin down Zing crossed 20 boards, giving Katie plenty of overall hook. Nearly four degrees of entry angle and lots of continuation through the pins, exiting the pin deck on the 19th board. The pin-up Zing Hybrid has more overall down lane motion with a greater angle of entry. As you can see from the graph comparison of the pin-up versus the pin-down, the pin-up was a bit stronger and sharper down lane. The pin-down was smoother with a more controlled move off the spot. The Zing Hybrid, when compared to the original Zing, was cleaner and sharper. It traveled a bit longer before making a sharp move through the pocket. Its added length is all that Katie needed to stay online and hold pocket. Wayne Gripsky, our resident stroker, gets 23 boards of total hook from the pin down Zing Hybrid. He gets lots of continuation through the pins. The pin down drilling allows Wayne to control the back end of the lane and still get plenty of hit and carry. The pin-up Zing Hybrid is sharper off the spot and crossed nearly 25 boards with an even greater angle of entry. The pin-up drilling is ideal for when Wayne wants to open up his angles and take advantage of the area the Zing Hybrid has created. When comparing the Zing Hybrid to the original Zing, it's easy to see the original Zing's motion is sooner and less angular down lane than the Zing Hybrid. Both crossed about the same amount of total boards but the hybrid's motion happened further down the lane and is more dynamic. The extra length makes it a perfect complement to the original Zing Solid. Chuck Norris is a power player who likes to open up his angles. The Zing Hybrid is perfect for Chuck. The pin down gives him an astonishing 28 boards of total hook and lots of continuation with a pretty strong motion off the spot. The pin-up Zing Hybrid flared a bit more, making it more responsive to the dry part of the lane. It had the same amount of total hook as the pin down, but even more continuation. The pin-up Zing Hybrid is a power player's dream ball. Lots of length, tons of recovery, with plenty of continuation. That's a recipe for lots of strikes. Comparing the Zing Hybrid to the Zing Solid, you see just enough difference in the motion to make these two balls great additions to your tournament and league arsenal. The Zing Hybrid is just long enough and sharp enough to be the perfect go-to ball when the Zing Solid starts to go a bit too soon or hook a bit too much. With Keanu, there are two types of messengers. The helicopter messenger with the pin down and the guided missile with the pin up. Either way, they're exciting to watch. The use of Dynamicore aids in increasing the strike percentage by increasing the coefficient of restitution. Put a little more zing in your game. Add the zing hybrid to your arsenal. Wow, that's radical.